What's up everyone, it's Ricky Lopez here and I just want to talk about this video that I just um, saw. Uh, for those of you who do not know, there is a video, viral video that happened like a week ago or so. It was on Twitter for, <laughs> like I said, these stands be tweeting some crazy stuff. But some of the stuff um, they be tweeting, it was this video, it was like, um, the caption was crazy Mexican uh, gets smacked or gets hit by a teacher or whatever. I think that was the title and I was like, what? And so I clicked the link to the video. So I'm like, oh my gosh, this looks like a fight. So I paused it and then, you know, and I was like, yo, but I gotta do this college work. No, not, not college work. Yeah, I did have to do the college work. I had to file for my financial aid and stuff. So I got time for this foolishness. And so now that I have time, you know, I just saw it and I was like, I was shocked. And I wasn't shocked, I was like, Like wow, <laughs> wow! Like it felt like deja vu, cause I, cause I, I don't know if you guys know, but I, the, I used to back in my middle school days, you know, they were crazy children, just like that kid right there. I'm telling you, these kids these days and kids back then, you know, they would push us, up, go up on the, um, all up on these teachers' faces. They would, um, they would walk out of classrooms, do all this crazy stuff, yell on the top of their lungs. I don't know, like, it's just, kids are crazy. Like, I feel the way depression is being treated and mental illness is being taken serious more nowadays, I feel like anger management should be added to the list. You know, I guess that gets is now getting into people's head that, you know, if you're, you know, think you're all bad and all that tough and think you're all that, that you're gonna get, um, that you're gonna get what you want. But in this video, <laughs> that was not the case. Okay, so there was this music teacher. You guys, you guys need to see it. Oh, come on. You guys, if you haven't seen it now, you should have seen it by now. But this video is pretty much about where this music teacher is like standing still. The kid is just crazy talking smack all up on him. And then the kid threw a basketball on him or whatever. And then that's when, you know, he started fighting and all that. You know, he punched him, punched him and stuff. And then now, and then that's when the teacher came in and you had to pull him away to get, uh, pull him away. And it's like, I will say this, this was the, that was the first time I ever saw a teacher, you know, fight back. Usually, um, it would be like an officer or police officer that would come in and arrest a student and take the student to the office and then call their parents and, you know, all that. All that drama. But this was the first time the teacher actually took matters into his own hands. And I feel sorry for him. I really did. Like, he was just standing still like... And then, you know, and I know where he snapped, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, like, now the question is, should he have hit a student? My, there are two types of moralities. One morality is what I personally think. And one is what, you know, the logical side of me thinks. So the logical side of me is like, hell, heck no. The teacher should have kept this cool down. He should have, I mean, you guys, I mean, for the sake of him, I mean, you may hate that job, but at the end of the day, that's a job, okay? That job is paying your bills, and it's like, that job, it's a job, like, I get it, like, it's a job, like, do you really want to let this little kid control your emotions and get the best out of you, and make you, make, um, you want this kid to make you lose your job just because you lost your cool, like, I feel that wasn't cool at all, like, you should have called the police, you could have called 911, doesn't matter, like, if that kid was talking smack about you, forget it, you know, all bets are off, like, call, call someone, call security, you should have smacked them. Um, but my morality, what the real Ricky would have thought was like, yeah, beat the crap out of him because clearly someone in his life was, wasn't able to, you know, give him spankings uh, growing up and he thought, you know, he got away with many things growing up. You could tell he was getting away with many things because for some, let's be honest, like, my parents, you know, taught me better than that. I would, the reason why I am today is because of my parents. Clearly that person did not have stable parents or parents that were able to teach him, you know, decent moral, moral rights. Like, they couldn't teach him anything. So, that's why he was the way he was. And so, I personally thought, you know what, if your parents aren't gonna, you know, give you a good, uh, good old fashioned spanking, you know, beating, then this teacher might as well, okay, might as well spank you, cause you can't go out into the real, <laughs> into the real world talking like that. You're not gonna get a job. No one's gonna want to be with you. 
you're gonna get into trouble with people and you know this guy in my opinion set him straight but at the end of the day the law is the law and the law says no you can't be doing that and so yeah the law is the law I mean me personally I hope he, I hope I hope I hope that guy moves away like if I was if I was in the music teacher because I want because that could have been me in the future um, I'm not a music. I'm not gonna be a music teacher. I'm gonna be an art teacher. But that could be me in the future, where I have to deal with ignorant children. But if I was him, and they, those children were talking the way they were, and those children were also filming, like what kind of student films? Like I feel like if you're filming something like that, you're just as guilty. You're not. You're not. You're you're off task. Um, in my opinion, I feel like um, he should just go away. He sh the teacher should move. Okay, clearly he needs to go to a better school, a school where students would appreciate him. And people be like, well, all schools are like that. All schools have rousy chil rowdy children. Well, wrong. Um, there are different schools, you know, depending on where you're at, you can go to a private school. Some private schools are better. There are some, there are good schools and there are bad schools. Okay, I don't care what anybody says. Um, clearly that school wasn't a good fit for him, so maybe if I was him, I would just move. Um, go to a better school. Go, go to somewhere where someone's going to treat you with respect. Okay, and that student, he should be expelled. I mean, he should be expelled. Um, but better yet, he should also spend a night in jail. I want to send him to jail, but you can't send him to jail. I mean, just send him to juvie. Send him to juvie and lock away, throw away the key. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, you guys, you guys have a great day, and um, that was my thoughts. And um, you know, I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you next time.